Okay, welcome. Welcome in my video. Okay, okay, I will show you how to use one of the techniques that you can merge polygons. But what I do first, I will cut and I will make a cylinder. Control R. Now you can. Now what we use probably our bisect tool because I want to show you one of the techniques I can use bisect oh no this is which shouldn't really happen sometimes bisect doesn't work very well now <coughs> If we go to vertices, separate selection, we have separate selection. If you want to join it together, use option join in a gig. So we now have one polygon. I just want to show you as best as I can. The interesting thing that you can use bridge tool in different ways. Ctrl A and uh, loops. Now what we can use Ctrl A tool bridge but we can also use we have to have closed loop and if we use merge they will be well get together. Okay now what are you thinking to do? I can also <coughs> uh, what I can do, what else I can do? Alt Alt X Alt X And even if you delete face, Ctrl F, you can use make edge face, or you can or you can use a tool called grid fill. Oh, you can make new face. And uh, also. What I'm thinking to show you, to quick welding. Oh no, I didn't feel hole here. Grey feel is nice tool. It's very quick when it comes to weld faces. What if I select two faces? This creates clever. Oh no, this is a little bit different, but it looks okay. Oh, it's different when you use simple blending. Very, very quick option, option to weld to make face dissolve. I don't know what option face split means. Now I will quickly show you in bridge option. Ctrl A, bridge edge loops and merge. So you can merge polygons like this. Very quick way of merging everything together. C loop, loops must be closed. So when you move a sing single edge, vertices won't be overlapped. 